Hello everybody. Oh, kind of miserable weather day today. Uh, just quick update on what happened yesterday. Uh, first, first of all, the transfers that I spoke about yesterday uh, have gone through at least uh, the Piontek and the uh, Egoin transfers. To no one's surprise, um, that got done. We also had. Um, the big transfer from uh, De Jong to Barcelona, which will happen in summer for more than 80 million euros. Uh, pretty amazing, but he is a great talent. Uh, so yeah, I'm curious how he will fit in at Barcelona, but it might be a good investment for the future for them. And given that they pipped uh, PSG to the finish line, says a lot about uh, the standing of Barcelona versus the standing of PSG. Uh, I don't want to insinuate too much, but I also have a feeling that ever since uh, Neymar went to PSG, uh, Barcelona is trying to uh, put a wrench in PSG's uh, plans. Might be. Speaking of PSG, they of course have the Rabiot situation where they actually need a midfielder and because he's not prolonging his contract, uh, they don't let him train, which caused them trouble with the league office. I think it's a pretty shitty move by uh, PSG. He's under contract, you cannot force him. I mean, I understand that he wants to wait, so let him play and uh, to clear himself said he needs every player at the moment, especially midfield. Uh, it is so interesting to me that when the Champions League draw was made, um, PSG against Manchester United seemed to be a foregone conclusion. Now everything but, and yesterday in the cup, I think Neymar got him injured. Uh, we have to see how long he will be out. But that's another one. I mean, um, PSG's chances are surely dropping. And similar with Tottenham, uh, where now Dortmund, I think, is in the clear role as a favorite. Um, so yeah, interesting developments. Uh, another one tra transfer I forgot yesterday that is kind of a head scratcher to me is Palotelli from Nice to Marseille. <sighs> yes, Palotelli won, won it out, but why do you go to uh, to the immediate rival? I mean, that's not gonna fly well with anyone, and I'm not sure what Mar Mar Marseille is getting. I really like Palotelli, I really do, and I just wish that he could get he could get it together because he would be an amazing. Striker. This is really absolutely wasted talent. Uh, he is not Serie A talent. He is really he could play um, Liga and talent. He could play in a top club at Serie A if he just would be uh, the player and not uh, you know if he just would concentrate on being a player. Um, yeah, to me it's a little bit of a puzzling move, uh, but I guess Marseille really needs a good striker. They are taking a risk. That's for sure, but they want to get into the top three. They probably need to get in the top, top three. Uh, what else do we have? Um, yeah, Barcelona lost yesterday in the Copa del Rey to Sevilla 2-0. Um, yeah, if you don't play Messi, Suarez, and if uh, um, Prince starts his first game for Barcelona, yeah, it's weird because he, t he tells me how serious Barcelona is taking this competition. I think they want to see whether they can win it with a second string squad and if not, they uh, it's not much lost because I mean they've been winning the Copa del Rey regularly anyway, so it might not be that much of a priority. And yeah, lastly, we have uh, yeah PSG beat Strasbourg, I think 2-0, uh, where Neymar got uh, in, in injured. And of course, the big game that everyone was talking about, Burton Albion against Manchester City and it's 0-1. So Manchester City reaches the final with an aggregate score of 10-0. Bravo, League Cup. Um, we have another game today. I completely, I thought they're, they're playing Tuesday, Wednesday, not Wednesday, Thursday. So tells you how much I followed it. Well, that's it for me for today. Let me know what you thought about all these little topics that I had. Um, I think the transfer news are probably the biggest uh, ones out there. They are more in, in interest than the actual results. Uh, give me a thumb up if you enjoyed this video. Subscribe to my channel if you want to see more of these, and I'll talk to you soon. Bye.
Hey there, I really hope you enjoyed this video. And if you did, here are some videos and playlists that might be of interest to you too. Also, please consider subscribing to my channel as it will give you all the updates on my channel, all things My Soccer Universe. And with that, I want to wish you a wonderful day.